Good morning, good morning, good morning. This is Robin from Roaming with Rover, and we are on day seven of the 12 days of Christmas. Day seven of the 12 days of Christmas, and we have this morning two more, more turmeric, turmeric moringa herbal tea to same. Let's see what we have today. Turmeric. in here all right Let's see what this smells like mm, don't care for that hmm but sometimes this tea smells different than this once it seeps so let's give it a let's give it a little dip in the bath Oh, boy, I don't know about this one. It's getting dark already. Oh, I don't know. I don't know about this one, y'all. I don't know. Okay, let's see what's in this thing. We have, I lost my place. Turmeric Moringa Herbal Tea to Sane. It says, turmeric, moringa, ginger, and black pepper. We've got 65% turmeric, turmeric, 15% moringa, 10% ginger, and 10% black pepper. Well, this could be interesting. Mm, I don't like that at all. I don't... It must be the Moringa that I'm not liking because whatever that scent is, it's very strong. And I've not had that scent in anything else before. So we're gonna let it we're gonna let it seep and then we will see. We will see. So yesterday's tea with that heavy, heavy black pepper, I could not drink it at all. I had I gave it to Mr. and he finished it up. I could not drink it. Uh, so it just had way too much black pepper in it for me. It was burning my throat. So it was a bust. That one couldn't do it. So we'll see what today's tea brings. It might just be the flavor today I'm not going to care for. And that will be a first. Yeah. Mm, not loving that at all. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, hope your guys' day went well yesterday. I worked yesterday and I had a busy, busy day doing videos. And, oh, yes, it is. Today is... New Year's Eve day, so I am, I have, I have a lot of things planned today around here, tidying up and rearranging and putting away and that kind of stuff, um, making videos, it's just, just busy work, just like always, um, making some plans for calendaring type stuff. I don't even think I'm leaving the house today. I hope I don't have to leave the house today. That That's my goal, is to not leave my house today. So today up. is the kind of day where we're supposed to be deciding if we are going to be making New Year's resolutions. I do not, as a rule, make New, use, make New Year's resolutions because I know I don't ever keep them. Uh, I have a couple of things that I like to make more goals than resolutions. One of my goals is to do better at my calendaring. One of my goals is to be better at keeping up on my bookkeeping for my business. I'm terrible at that. And here comes the end of the year and then I'm frantically getting all my stuff together. But that's the same goal I have every year. So that's how that goes. And that's another goal, and, and y'all know how this goes, is not, not buying 
more yarn. You guys know how that goes. We, we, so I don't even put that out there. But, um, yeah. So today is really just more organizing. And I've been doing that all week. Organizing and rearranging and putting things where they belong. And just kind of getting things under control a little bit. Oh, shoot. I do have to do something today. Honestly, if they're not open, I've got some books that need to go back to the library. But I'll bet you they are not even open today. What is today? Sunday. Bet you they're not even open they're today. So it's not going to be a problem. And I know they're not going to be open tomorrow. So I don't think that's going to happen today. Hmm. We'll see. I may have to leave the house today. We shall see. But if it is... It'll be a short little run. All right, let's try this out. I'm almost afraid to try it. Oh, not, no. It's a medium. Okay. It's, it's not, it's not as light as the green tea. It's, it's not as dark as the black teas. So it's a medium. It's got, got bits in here that's for sure okay still hot I can't even describe that taste it just hot dirt let's let it cool off a bit and you know it definitely always it seems to always taste different after it cools off so we'll 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 try that we'll see what it tastes like after it cools off because <laughs> ew i don't like this one i don't like this one i definitely did not i and i like ginger boy it's got to be the moringa let's look up and see let's see if we can figure out what moringa is see if that helps Let's see if that helps. Moringa. M-O-R-I-N-G-A. It's a supplement. It's a plant that is native to India rich in antioxidants, vitamins, and minerals, praised for thousands of years for having a wide range of health benefits. So much so, in fact, the National Academy of Sciences calls it a living cornucopia. Wow. But what is this? Immune system, energy? Huh. I don't like it. Still too hot. Okay. It's getting a little better. If it cools off, maybe that won't be such a strong flavor. Ooh, you know what? And I've had people say this before. A lot of people that drink tea, they put cream in it, put a little milk in it, a little honey in it. I'll bet you if you put a drop or two of honey in this, it wouldn't be as, it would be much more palatable. This might be one where we have to put a drop of honey in it to make it a little more palatable. Because, you know, I've been drinking every one of these just completely black. And a drop of honey or a, a, just a splash of cream might make all the difference. So that could definitely be, because that's how I drink my tea is black. But, you know, half of the, half of the world puts tea and sh uh, cream and sugar in their tea. I just never have. I've always drank it black. 
And this might be one that, that it would definitely need that. It's, it's getting better. It's getting better. I think I just need to get used to that flavor a little bit. As it's cooling off, it's getting a little better. Hmm. Okay. I could drink it. This is not one that I'm going to choose ever. But I... If it's presented to me, I could drink it. Wow. Okay. So, not a first choice. Not by a long shot. But, but still not as bad as that. Um, oh, I can't even remember the name of it now. The one that I called the dirt, the green dirt tea. Mm. Which I'm going to, I really want to try that one again now having tried all these different ones and getting used to all of these different flavors. Um, good Lord, what are you bringing over here? A spoon for the honey. A dribble, dribble of, of... That's chocolate. That's not going to go in there. Um, so, let's do that. Let's try the... We've got this weird honey stuff. I would have... Mm. It's not weird. It has the cone in it. Pure cone honey. Homemade. I come from, from what's his name? Texas. Okay. We've got some pure honey from Texas here. Let's do that. Let's put just just a tiny, tiny, not even a half a teaspoon. See if that helps. See, it's got the honeycomb right in the jar. We had a friend when we were when we were living in Texas working in the oil fields. We had a friend there, one of the one of the oil field guys, and he would bring us stuff like that all the time. He had a little farm, a little ranch, and when he would go on days off, he would bring stuff like he would bring us bags of pecans, and he would bring us honey, and he would bring us watermelons and cantaloupes and all kinds of stuff. So you never knew what he was going to come around the corner with. One time, he, one, oh, eggs, 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 so many eggs. One time he came around the corner with a rattlesnake. He had run, he had hit it when he was going down the road. So he brought us this freshly killed rattlesnake and Mr. Skinned it. You can see the videos of it. That definitely helped. That definitely helped. Oh yeah, just that little tiny touch of sweetness, just that half a teaspoon of honey in there. Oh, that helped tremendously. Mm, I, I would like this now. Okay, that made all the difference. So, that's something to think about. With any of these teas, if this is something that you haven't enjoyed or you think maybe you don't like the flavor of, Maybe a couple, of, just a splash of cream or like I say, you saw, I barely put not even half a teaspoon of honey in there and it just made all the difference in the flavor. So now I can enjoy this cup of tea and I hope you are able to sit and enjoy a cup of tea with us, with me. Um, I have so many videos coming out over the next couple of weeks. I hope you're able to catch a few of them. I've got a knit along starting. I know, weird, right? I have some giveaways coming up. I hope you'll join us for those and just, just catch some of the videos we've got coming up. We will see you soon. Bye-bye.